dead as a doornail. When someone says that something is dead as a doornail, it means that it's not working, it's broken, it's unequivocally deceased. The oven doesn't turn on, there's no heat, it's dead as a doornail. Your partner might say, just as she wanted to bake banana bread. Maybe you're telling your friend why you didn't reply to his messages. Sorry, my phone is as dead as a doornail and I haven't had time to get it repaired. Put your luggage on this other scale. That one's dead as a doornail. The employee at the airport check-in counter might tell you. As you can tell, if something is dead as a doornail, it's busted, out of order, out of service, malfunctioning, or just plain finished. You can also say that a previously living thing is dead as a doornail, but it sounds a little disrespectful, so you'll only normally hear it applied to inanimate objects. The idiom, dead as a doornail, is used by Shakespeare in the 1500s, but is perhaps most famously found in Charles Dickens's A Christmas Carol in 1843. Normally, nails that have been driven into wood can be pulled out, but in the days when blacksmiths made nails by hand, they were very expensive and would thus be subject to theft. So, door makers would bend over the end on the inside of the door, called clinching, so that the nail could not be removed from the outside by thieves. Your plants are dead as doornails. When was the last time you watered them? Your grandma might ask you on a visit to your place. Perhaps you are trying out an appliance for the first time. This thing won't turn on. It's as dead as a doornail. I think we have to take it back to the store. Oh no, my car is out of battery. It's dead as a doornail. We need to call roadside assistance. Your friend might tell you as his car rolls to a stop. So, the next time that something isn't working, isn't turning on, isn't showing any signs of life, you can say that it's dead as a doornail.